So everyone, it's your girl Mercedes of Mercedes Glam Boutique coming to you. Today I want to wish you all a happy Thanksgiving. Um, I'm currently on my way out the door, you guys, and so I'm getting ready for the evening. I'm heading over to family's house to spend a lovely, wonderful uh, Thanksgiving dinner with my relatives. So <laughs> I'm here uh, getting ready for the day. So as you can see, I still have the tag on my <laughs> on my wig, you guys, and the lace is still attached. So I dug out one of my lace wigs that I had done a review on last year, and this is um, by It's a Wig. It's called the company is It's a Wig Lace Front uh, Lace Beauty in the color DX3147. There's no picture, okay. So I just put it on. This is the second wig that I put on to see how it clashes with what I'm wearing today and um, and how it looks with my makeup today. So um, as I'm looking at it, <laughs> I'm loving it. So this is what I'm wearing today, you guys. I just have to take this lace off and, um, and cut it and rock it. Um, I have on um, this necklace set comes with the earrings by uh, Mercedes Glam Boutique and um, I am loving it you guys I have on an awesome sweater dress from Shoe Dazzle um, let me see if there's a name for this dress let's see this is the thing that came in from Shoe Dazzle and I purchased this last year as well I had purchased it in a large and the large was extremely big. Mind you, I'm a big gal. So I'm like, wow. It was really big. And um, it just says Oxford. That's just it. And um, it's this tan or beige color knitted dress, which goes to below, just below my knees. Um, I really want you guys to see, you know, how it looks. Uh, and I also have one this vest. Let me see if I can tilt this down. Oh, you can see the dress. Okay. So, it's a v-neck uh, um, um, sweater uh, dress. And as you can see, it goes to my knees, right? And then I have one that's beautiful, I don't know what you call this type of Mongolian, I don't know what, um, vest type thing but it's made with a belt as you can see with some studded detail on it and a zipper in the middle so this is what I have on okay the dress is in a size medium because the large is extremely big so I ordered another one and I got the medium fits excellently as you can see I love the way the sleeves come down um, over my wrist and um, the length is still stretchy once you wear some nice um, undergarments under it, you know, it, it fits wonder wonderfully. And um, I keep saying them. I'm sorry, you guys. So my boots, I have on a pair of boots from um, Shoe Dazzle as well. I want to show you guys the boots. Sorry about that, you guys. Sorry about that. So I'm going to try to see if I can get off my these boots. Because these boots go above my... Um, my knee, which I've been looking for some boots that I can, you know, do that with. So I purchased, I think, like two or three pairs of boots, you guys. Oh, sorry about that. From Shoe Dazzle, I'm gonna post pictures as well, but I just want to show you guys. So these are the boots, and this is the first time that I'm wearing them. Aren't they beautiful? These are from Shoe Dazzle as well. You know how you have, um, some of us have like thick calves or wide calves and it's really hard for us to find boots to fit. Well, these are size 11 from Shoe Dazzle. Very roomy. I have on a pair of stockings and I had to put socks on because I have too much room in the boots. So I'm wearing this. And the name of the boots is called Katie. And it's in a tan color, Katie. Okay. And for my purse, you know, I don't have, do I have a black beautiful bag that I would like to wear? I really don't. But I also have this pocketbook that I purchased from, ooh, from, um, 
hot look like a year and a half ago and I never wore it yet so I finally took it out I might just throw this on just because you know throw this with my outfit just because it kind of clashes and just to give a pop of color but isn't this beautiful you guys it's like an orangey rust color and it's made by Lulu so this is going to be my outfit so I'm about to go ahead and um cut this lace off and I'll be back with pictures okay you guys Oh, I didn't tell y'all about my makeup. I had just dropped my, I keep going down and coming back up. I'm so sorry. Because <laughs> my, my palette fell on the floor. So, this is by um, NYS. It's the Nude or No Palette. Everybody knows about the Nude or No Palette, right? So, oops. did it just get jammed on me? Oh. Yeah, so, this is the Nude or No Palette. And what I have on my eyes, you guys, um, on my inner tear duct area. I have on this second color right here in the first row and um, on the first inner part that's what I have right there and on the second part of the lid I have this beautiful peachy um, color right here and on the third part I have this beautiful shimmery brown okay and drag that into the crease and on my lid I have, what do I have on my lid, on my lid, I have, um, oh, on my eyebrow bone, I have this awesome light color right here, and, you know, that just completes my look, underneath, um, the lower lash line, I have this beautiful brown color right here, and that's it, you guys, for my lips, oh, yes, I forgot, so I just put some brown, um, I think it's a lip eyeliner that I had purchased. And um, it's called Smoky Espresso. And so I bought this actually for my eyebrows and it was like too light for my eyebrows. So I used it as a lip liner. So what I did was I put this Smoky Espresso all over my lips, right? Because I wanted like a matte look something to hold my lipstick so I put this on I know I could have used concealer but I didn't want concealer so it's too light I didn't want to put on a dark concealer I wanted this lip liner because I love this I mean this eyeliner because it's really matte when it goes on and then I took out two lipsticks by Nika K that I plan on rocking today whichever one I grab in my purse is what I'm going to use but the one I have on right now is um brown sugar 404 Okay, and it looks like that. It has like it's like a little pearlish, you know, type of brown color, but I put that one over the um brown liner on my lips and I mind you I colored in my whole both top and bottom lip of with the brown smoky brown espresso. So as you guys can see, this is the look damn good today, right? So I'll be doing the damn thing, y'all. <laughs> but anyways, um, yeah. So I'm about to cut this lace off. All right? I'm about to cut this lace off. For my um face makeup, I just have on my matte foundation, liquid foundation. I have the bold eyelashes pop I mean eyebrows popping right now. That's the way I did it. Yeah, I only tweezed the um outer part of my eyebrows, yeah, because I didn't have my little, you know, razor thing. It's kind of dull. So I sister still had to do what she had to do to get it on and pop it and looking sexy. And I did it. I did it. I did it with the thick bow lash. I mean, eyebrows, yes. And here for the lashes, I do have on some bow human hair lashes. I don't know what the company name is. Um, some non-name brand. And um, I have on Urban Decay's um gold glitter um thing under my <laughs> my lower lash line you guys and that's it so um stay tuned for pics i'll be back all right love y'all bye i'll be back <laughs>